Hello there, my friends, and welcome to the Dream Snap results for Outer Space Challenge. We have a winner. We have a couple second places and a bunch of people in top 10 that we're going to take a look in the end of this video. But for now, let's start with some of the most interesting submissions that I've seen before. And I was really curious how they were going to rank. Let's see who got robbed today. And I have a scientific fact for you. If you subscribe to this channel and leave a like to this video, you have 5% less chance to get robbed in your next Dream Snap challenge. Trust me, it works. If you don't believe it, just test it. What do you have to lose? <laughs> Let's get right into it. We have Sig Beans. Looks like a lot less people have been submitting the last week or two. Only 1500 Moonstones for rank 7800. For Holiday Cheer, I got 2500 for rank 7000. Okay, I was pretty happy with this one, even though it's a little bit basic. So this is on PC, Mac. This is like the regular, uh, not, not PlayStation. Wow, this is crazy. So actually very few people participated in this challenge, it looks like. Probably the least amount we've had it ever. And I hope, I really hope it has to do with, uh, with the fact that not many people had the futuristic tags. I really hope that's the reason and not because the Disney Dream Light Valley is dying. That would be bad. Okay, let's see what we got. That looks very futuristic and symmetrical too. Wow, this shot is very, it's fully symmetrical. Great outfit. What the hell? Why is this only 1500? This this deserves more. It's a simple shot. I will I will give you that. But it's so well executed. I love it. I love it. I I think you deserve more moonstones. Rachel Joy loved this week. I loved this week so much and was a bit gutted by my results, but I'm wondering if I needed more tags. I loved creating it though. And seeing everyone's amazing photos, this was exploring a new planet with Eve. That's the most important thing as long as you're having fun. Uh, 1200, let's take a look. Hmm. That is a very, very red submission. <laughs> the colors are super vibrant. It is a photo of a screen, though, so maybe it does skews the colors a little bit. I mean, it's a great shot. It does look like a different planet, for sure. One thing that I feel like would help the shot is if you zoomed in a little bit, so you had some of these flowers being a part of the foreground. This way it would look a little bit more immersive, but I love the idea of the shot. Nicely done. Winter Dragonfly. Ouch, I did so bad. My results for it came from outer space. I'm not surprised. I hated it, so I can't really expect others to like them. 600. Okay, this is a good uh, indication of how many people participated. So 600 you get if you are in top 50%. Which means there's there was at least... 80,000 people participating. Usually we've been getting like 150k plus, so it looks like potentially almost half of the people didn't participate in this one. That's a great shot, though. I would say maybe it's a little bit chaotic. There's a lot of details, a lot of things going on. Maybe maybe, maybe, maybe that's, that's why it didn't score that high, but the colors are gorgeous. It's so vibrant. Yeah, I, I really hope that more people participate next week. We need more votes. <laughs> Echo Star EST. Not sure what happened this week. I still love it, but I thought for sure this was 4K worthy with 2020 tags. You got 900. Okay, let's take a look. Okay. Okay, this is gorgeous. This is a beautiful shot. I don't know. I feel like this week results are even more random than usual. I agree. I agree. This this definitely should have done better than 900. Tasha Maria out of space. Best I have done. Top 100. Rank 82. Let's go. Now we have a win. Oh, that is pretty. That is a good looking submission. Very futuristic. Love it. And it's a door one. Getting in top 100 with Endor Submission is not an easy fit. Well done. Miss Murder. Results. I thought I nailed it. 2,500. Well, to be fair, 
2500 is still kind of nailing it. It's it's pretty good result. Oh, Capybara and Wally is adorable. It's a beautiful shot. I agree. Definitely futuristic vibe. The light. I know you you were probably going for like a dark look. Maybe maybe that's that's why it like it it, it, it the colors are a little bit toned down because of the lack of light in the room but it's a great looking shot and but but also 2500 is a, is a pretty decent result especially for this week where everything seems to be completely random lisa b my third best rank okay let's see what is your third best rank uh 4k moonstones rank 608 i used nine futuristic 10 wally and suggested tags whoa that is pretty low tags. That is actually very low tags. And it's a symmetrical shot. Man, symmetrical shots look good. Congratulations, Lisa. We have Alexis who says, I think tags saved me. The submission wasn't my favorite, but I had already spiraled for a day on it. I was blown away by the outer sub other submissions and I was shocked to receive 4K. I think the tags saved me though. I also feel like it's easier to get 4K on Switch. I don't think so. I I would say it's the opposite because Switch leaderboards is mixed together with Xbox, uh, PC, and Mac, which means it's probably the hardest to do a submission on Switch. So I disagree. I think I think if you do well on Switch, that's that's even bigger achievement. 16 and 20. Okay, the tags are not crazy high, but they are way higher than the minimum i think what saved it is a beautiful vibe i love the combination of the lights the shelves and the the bushes the divine walls it gives it a very very nice look and i have not shown you the submission I'm, i apologize <laughs> that is a nice shot love it mandy also says focus on the tags third week with good results i think because i've been focusing on tags it has helped my score kind of a bummer, honestly. 4,000 rank 807. And yet you have an indoor submission with very few items. Okay, define focus on tags. How many tags is in this picture? I can't imagine there is more than 10 of any of the main tags. Also, can somebody explain to me? Because I've been trying to find the answer for this for a long time. How come some rooms, they have like, white gray ceiling white ceiling but some rooms have this uh, like exposed brick ceiling how does this work is is that size related like if you have a small room it's gonna have a brick ceiling if it's a large room it's gonna have a white ceiling how do i force no actually i've tested that and i, I couldn't replicate a way to make ceilings in my rooms like this so please if you know how to do this Tell me in the comments, because I've been I've been breaking my head trying to figure this out for a long time. That's a great submission, though. I think that's why it got good results. Sarah from NC says that she got robbed. 600 moonstones. I thought I did better than this. I'll find out how Chloe's submission did when I get home. Hopefully better than mine. I I agree. I agree. It it it's absolute robbery to have 600 for clear. I mean. Even if you don't know Ga Guardians of the Galaxy, even if you've never seen a movie and don't recognize a single reference, it's still a fantastic submission. I'm really sorry, Sarah. You absolutely got robbed. Colin got my highest score yet. <laughs> I love Dream Snap. Some people get absolutely destroyed. Some people get their best results of all times. Top one, 376 rank. Damn. That lighting. That lighting, though. That's pretty. I love it. Nicely done. Mystique got rank 13. I'm actually very surprised. It's probably one of my best, my least favorite submissions. Dream snaps are weird. I mean, come on. It has a great vibe. The filter also works so well with the shot. Congratulations. Enjoy your moonstones. Becky Louise, Space Fairy, did better than I thought it would. Thank you, everyone that voted for my picture. So here's the shot. Wow, the tags are seven and four. That's that's like so minimal. 
But it's a beautiful shot as well. And the results are... 2500. I wonder if it's the tags, because the shot itself is so pretty. I want to do an experiment. I want to create identical shots on two accounts. But in one, I hide a bunch of tags behind somewhere. And in the other, I don't. So I literally, I will try to hit minimum tags in one submission and then like a billion tags on the other submission, but make them look identical. And I'm curious if we can see the results. The only problem, I did start a new account for this kind of experiments, but I don't have any items on it. So I cannot create identical submissions on both of my accounts. So gonna have to wait until I can get some more items. Ghost says, okay, I'm convinced. So after this week, I'm 1000% convinced that tags should be number one priority and they matter more than anything. I did this snap in like five minutes and I was falling asleep and it just hit a bunch of tags behind Eve house and threw a random outfit. Still got 4000 moonstones. Wild. Rank 3000. Okay. And here's the submission. It is It is a very simple shot. It, it, is, it is well organized, but also like... What if it's not tags? What if it's just having a simple shot that looks good? It's not overcomplicated. It it's very like very clean. There is nothing extra. It's just it's a fantastic shot, so I don't know. It it I, I feel like it could get that result on its own even without the tags, but there is no way for us to test for it. That's the, the frustrating part, because Maybe, maybe you're right, and I also believe that tags are important, but I feel like tags do not necessarily mean that bad pictures with high tags will score high. It just allows good pictures to potentially climb maybe a little bit in rank. It, it gives you like slight edge, but like I want to know exactly how big is that edge. Is that too much to ask? Probably is. We have Minudra. Low results, let's take a look. I had all the tags, but I did lack in some space-themed items, I guess. I do way better on outfit challenges anyway. 600, okay, let's take a look at submission. I think you're right. Maybe it didn't look space enough. Especially compared to a lot of shots. It's still a good shot, but the competition was really, really fierce this week. Oh my god, Pippin! No, Pippin! My worst results ever happens. Not sad. 900. On PlayStation. Wait. I literally just saw your Eric submission and it was mind blowing. Oh, come on. Come on, this is good. This is This is good. This this should be higher than 900. Come on. Come on, Disney Dreamlight Valley. What are you doing? You crazy. That was such a good idea to hold the, 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 the to put this stuff on the tables too. Man. That makes no sense. Countess Grotesque. I love this theme. Oh my Goodness, what a shot. What an absolute explosion of colors and lights. Rank 176. That is gorgeous. Absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. Congratulations. NA Rose. Ouch. It's been a while since I've been this low. 900. Let's take a look. I remember your submission. I absolutely remember your submission. It was great. The idea of tentacles was so good, but once again, people people probably didn't get it because they they just speed voted. It's a great shot. I'm sorry. All right, guys, let's take a look at our top ten. Rank six on PS5 by Dissimi. Dissimi has been killing it lately. That's awesome. Let's take a look. I mean, yes, yes, yes. That is a fantastic shot. Very well balanced. Nicely done. Ev Era. Rank 6. It was a late Tuesday submission, so I didn't have time to clean up since I thought it looked too cluttered. 
But I guess I didn't have I didn't have to worry about that. <laughs> Very happily surprised and grateful for the high rank. Congratulations, that is a high rank. Oof. This the palm tree on the left looks like tentacles. That is such a creative shot. I love this. I'm not surprised it did so well. It's the feel of it. Doing this in Forgotten Lands also is such a good idea because of the volcano. It just looks so futuristic. Well done. We have Dream Magic. It came from Outer Space Rank 2. Oh my god, I can't even believe this right now. I did not expect to get ranked 2. I didn't even think I was going to get 4k. This is like just so amazing. I never thought that I would ever get even in the top 10. I cannot believe this. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> wow. Dream Magic is freaking out and I'm so here for it. The funny thing, I wasn't even my favorite photo, but anything could happen though. That's just the way of Dream Snaps. And also my tags were Futuristic25, uh, Wally25, and I hope all of you have a happy Valentine's Day. Thank you so much, Dream Magic. Rank 2. Oh my god, that is so good. That is... One thing, why, one thing I see in common so far in top 10 shots. It's a night theme with bright lights, but not too bright. Not too bright. I feel like that's important. Like if you just drown an area in, in, in the light, it could take away from the shot. And I feel like that's what I did with my shot. And I feel like if I maybe did made it more tasteful and not just decided to burn your eye eyeballs off, maybe I could even get into top 10 myself. I don't know. We'll see. I'll keep I'll keep trying different things. Congratulations, Dream Magic. It's a beautiful shot. We have Keyloth with rank 8. I'm in shock. This is the highest rank I've ever gotten. Rank 8 for Indoor! Indoor submission in top 10. That doesn't happen very often, guys. That is that is incredible. That is a good shot, though. It's a great shot. Congratulations. We have rank 9 by Julie. Wow, Julie made it in top 10. Congratulations, Julie. I never expected this. Thank you, Snap Feedback, and everyone who voted. Rank 9, I'm still in shock. I take full responsibility. I... I I, 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 I had a hand in this, so I feel, I feel powerful. <laughs> no, but seriously, well done, Julie. You've been killing it lately, absolutely. Welcome back to the 4K streak. We have Cass with rank 2. When I tell you, I screamed when I opened my game, my mail. Rank 2, actually can't believe it. I've been in the top 10 twice, but never this high. Man, I want to be in top 10. <laughs> Wait, was I in top 10? Was my beach submission in top 10 or was it like 11? I feel like I've never been in top 10. Maybe one day. Rank 2, let's take a look. Another indoor submission in top 10. Ah, And you know what? Having indoor submissions in top 10 kind of proves the point. That maybe tags are not that crucial. Like, this is second place. I bet the tags here weren't crazy. Like, I know it looks like there's a lot of items, but it's definitely not hundreds hidden behind the walls. So you can still do extremely well without having hundreds of items. That is awesome. That is such a good looking room. And if, if we take a look at the other indoor one by Keyloth, like, this one doesn't have that many items at all. I, I have a feeling this one has, like, close to minimum tags. Keyloth, if you're watching this, please please let us know your tags if you if you have this information. This looks like it's like 10 tops of each. And it's still got number uh, like rank 8. That's unbelievable. But let's take a look at the winner by Crafty Peach. I'm completely floored. My dream snap always have so much depth and detail that I put into them. So it's great to finally set set my hard work acknowledged. Thank you whole, to all who voted. You're very welcome. <laughs> 12,000. Score 73. Oh, that's good. That's the good stuff. That's the highest score I've seen for sure this, this week. What a shot. And it's an outdoor one. So probably have a lot of tags if I were to guess. Great job. You did it. 
you finally got uh, all the hard work finally got acknowledged. Awesome. All right, guys, this is all I got for for today. What do you think? What do you think? Uh, why why do you think this week we had so little participation in Dream Snaps? Do you think it's temporary? Do you think we're gonna go back to the old numbers and potentially even higher? Maybe next week? And maybe even higher after the next update drops? Maybe more people will come back into the game? I certainly hope so. I'm, I'm hoping the update is gonna be good. I hope it's gonna bring something uh, on top of what they already promised so we can have some... Uh, like more players to come back and potentially even more new players to join the game and i'm not just saying this because i need more views on my channel that even though that would help but also it's gonna make dream snaps more fun and more fair if we have more people participating thank you for watching subscribe for more content and goodbye